here with Slickster Gaming, and welcome back to more Persona 4 Golden. How are you holding up, Kerb? I'm holding up. It's really cold outside, though. I really need to get under that Kotatsu. Or we could get under our covers in the bed. But our, is our bed like an electric blanket, then? I mean, I hope so, because it says our chill seems to have gotten even worse, so... Oh, what is going on? Uh, I mean, we need to go to bed. Oh, God, we feel dizzy. What's... Wait, something going is actually going on. on. No, oh, Ryoga! I can't see anymore. Well, it's a good thing we actually let Teddy stay over now. What the heck? Oh, <gasps> it actually happened. Huh? This is Sensei! You can hear Teddy's voice from far away. This is... The Kotatsu. Aww. Um... I tucked him in. I took his temperature. Next comes... Mm, ah, this calls for a cold pillow. Hang in there, Sensei. Your body feels heavy. Your vision... Blurs again. Your face, nonchalant. <laughs> A wry smile. Are we going to develop? Oh! oh! This is... It looks like you're having another dream. It asked us to it. Oh. Well, I came to say goodbye. It's been fun. Where are you going? You try to speak, but for some reason, you're unable to. I'm sorry. Don't worry. The fog in your world is gone. I'm sure you will have a peaceful future. It's a shame I won't be there to see it. Oh my god. <sighs> I love you. Now and forever. So... Goodbye. <laughs> Don't make that face. This is all for the best. Goodbye. Your vision begins to waver. You feel lightheaded, and it's like everything is being shrouded in darkness. Wow. Hmm. He, he looks like he's in pain. Yeah, I think it's a cold. Winter around here can be pretty unforgiving. Hmm. Looks like the ski trip will have to be pushed back. There's no point in going without Ryoga, after all. So, why'd you put him under a kotatsu? Isn't that supposed to be bad for you? Oh. Huh? Why not? The kotatsu is great from when you're shivering from the cold. Uh-huh. That's the cold, not a cold. They had to uh, drag us upstairs. Oh, oh no, wow. we stayed here for four days. God. Will Senpai be all right? Ah, uh, damn it. It's pissing me off that I can't do anything about this. <sighs> he should be okay. The medicine I picked up from the hospital appears to be working. It will still take a few more days, but Teddy is here to watch over him, so... Teddy, take care of Senpai for me. Of course. Leave it to Teddy. I've been sleeping with him every night. I suddenly am awake, and I feel both okay and not okay. A <laughs> <sighs> oh, fat lot of help that is. This is oh, this is actually happening, Teddy. You've been bedridden for a while, but it seems you've finally recovered. It only took a week. The sensei, don't worry, you have me. It would seem that Teddy has been taking care of you. Mm hmm. Good evening. Mm -hmm. I apologize for disturbing your night. 
There's something I must inform you about Marie, so I decided to contact you directly. Oh. I had a dream about her. What are you now about this? A dream? I see. Perhaps that has something to do with Marie's departure. Unfortunately, I have yet to pinpoint her location. However, there is something I have discovered. Do you remember what I said before? I told you that if I led you to Marie, it may lead to danger. I am concerned that this may turn out to be true. It is most likely that her destination is not found in the realm of man. I believe it will be a true test of your persona powers. Mm. So, until I come for you, I would suggest that you work to further your bonds with others. Gather your personas in the time you have, so that you can be ready when the time comes. Now, if you would excuse me. It seems Marie is in a very dangerous place. You should work to strengthen your bonds with your friends until Margaret comes for you. I only have one important one that isn't maxed yet, and that's it. <laughs> True. Mm hmm. You carry Teddy to bed and decide the rest for the day. I think that's fair. The third school term begins today. It seems that you've fully recovered. Sensei! Oh, I think you're okay now. Let's take care. You pull your winter clothes out of your dresser and leave for school. You obtain the midwinter Yasso uniform. Yasso. Oh, wow. Rather. Really? Yeah. Our midwinter school uniform. And yeah. it looks good. That looks. That's our best Yasso outfit of the mm -hmm. school outfits, it seems. Yeah, it is. I like it. I want that coat, too. Morning, Ryoga. Are you feeling better? I freaked out when Teddy told me how bad it was. You were kind of groaning that day when I went to see you, too. Well, even if we didn't plan it, I'm glad Teddy was there with you. He put everything he had into taking care of you. And mm -hmm. giving good gossip. I'm sorry I worried you. Ah, don't sweat it. You're all better now. Oh yeah, about the ski trip. We decided to hold off on that until another holiday. I'll set some of my New Year's money aside, so let's make our plans then. There is that block of holidays in February. I think that might be the time to do it. Ooh, nice. Happy New Year, everybody. I sure hope that this year will be just as great as the last one. Did you all get to celebrate the New Year in the proper way? By that, I mean, did you get to eat all the right foods? I had Zoni, Osichi, and of course, the Toshi Koshi noodles. You've got to have Toshi Koshi while the calendar's changing. But I completely forgot to get the Kagami Mochi. Even if you don't eat it, that's important too, right? I was in a rush, okay? But I figure that I can't be the only one who didn't ring in the new year, right? So, Amagi. No, wait. You look like you'd know. Kuanji. Well, what do you mean we look like we don't know things? <laughs> Tell me, what are you supposed to put on top of a Kagami Mochi? Oh shit, I don't know things. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know. Ah, uh, no! Kagami Mochi. Ooh, well, mochi is normally a food, so I'd want to go for an orange, but it seems like it's a tradition thing which makes me want to go for a coin. An incense stick on food just sounds like a bad idea. Um. Kagami Mochi, what is a Kagami? Okay, I am gonna go with a coin. No. Dang it, is it an orange? It's an orange. Dang it! See, here's the thing. There's like a certain like other character from a game that I know their name literally translates to Mandarin Orange, mm -hmm. and that doesn't sound like her name at all for the that one first part of it. I already forgot the word the Kagami, so I wasn't sure. Okay, so it's an orange. Fine, yeah. shoot. Not just any orange though. It's got to be a bitter orange called a Dai Dai. That means the several generations. Of course, it doesn't taste very good, but the symbolism of the thing is what matters here, you know? Did you all get that? 
don't make the same mistake I did when next year comes around. Your knowledge has increased. Congrats, Woohoo! Kurt. Thank God I know things. The new term has begun. It's been a while since you've met everyone at school. That means we've got a lot of quests to turn in. Oh, good point. Hello, sir. Sir? S sir? 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 <laughs> oh, <laughs> God. Oh. Hi. I was wandering around the shrine for a while on New Year's Eve and I was hoping that girl I like would show up. Isn't that creepy? <laughs> but in the end, she never did. And I caught a cold, too. It was the worst winter break I've ever had. There is no god. Whoa. Just take your animal guide. Is <gasps> this it? Oh, you're amazing. Where did you find this? There is a god! <gasps> I, I, I looked around all over one, but I never found it. Uh, once I give her this, she'll... Oh, thank you, my Cupid. Please take this. We got a Milkoy doll. Huh. Oh. Which we can put on the shelf. Hmm. Oh. Be sure to treasure that. I kept that in my room and I loved it. Now I'm giving it to you, Ryoga. Okay. Right. Good start, good start. Hi, Yosuke. Bye, Yosuke. Bye, jerk. <gasps> That's right, I said it. Uh, we are looking for over here, actually. Way. Oh, has a, she has a new one. Like, a new quest. Uh, uh oh. Slightly thrown off here. Ah, Ryoga. Won't she help me out again? Maybe we turn this one into her already. Maybe. Hmm, that is truly honorable of you. The dowsing rods I've been using until now have gotten quite damaged. Oh, no, I think I think we got the item for this before we start the quest, because we've had a few like that. Okay. I'd like you to find the ones that I will need to create new ones. According to the book I have, the only calico will be best. There. It no, is. that's a that's a Kingdom Hearts mixing thing. What are you talking about? It's a lot of RPG mixing thing. So true. I know it's rare, but I have high hopes that you'll be able to obtain them. Of course, I have something even rarer prepared as a reward for you. Uh, what about this? Well then, I ask that you bring me one Ori Calcum, which you somehow already have in your pocket. This is the first time I've ever seen one myself. You are truly impressive, Yoga. Now, I can create new rods. Well done. Now, don't be modest. Accept this. We got a silver tray. What? Uh, Alright. It is said that silver is better than gold. It is truly an excellent item. Then again, gold is more worthy of me. Haha. <laughs> I thank you, Ryoga. Ah, uh, let's go see if that's any good. Not you, okay. You know, it is really oh, wow. small, but it's also really inaccurate, so no. Yeah. I think we should Thanks. I do I'm curious because if it's just a tray, I think for one battle she should have it because I want to see her just throw a tray. That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> we could also check out those uh, other uh low accuracy items to see what they do. True, joke item stuff. Oh ha oh, her! Ah, Ryuga-kun, I know. Won't you do me a favor? Okay. That's, that's what this is about. You know I had you bring me the crystal ball before. I don't know if it had any effect or not. Last year was kind of average for me. Lucky you. In addition, I had so many expenses during January. One of the books I was reading had something that... Increased your luck with money just by keeping it around. Supposedly, it's called Golden Chains, but I want you to bring me three of it. Mm. I've already got them. True. I bet they're chains that'll form an inseparable bond between you and your money. Well, then, I'll be counting on you. Oh, you brought them to me right away. Mm -hmm. Won't you give them to me? Sure. What? Thank you. All the other ones, they don't give an option to be like, maybe you don't? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of odd. They're going to make me so happy. Now my stocks will soar. 
and my wallet will swell with money. Oh, this is a token of my gratitude. Thank you for your trouble. 65,000 yen! So I need a lot more money, but here's some of it to give away to you. I need to put these up as decorations the moment I get home. And then I'll look at my charts, run the numbers, check my astrological advisor. My epigonomic future is secured. I think she needs more help. <laughs> I think she needs uh, uh -oh. glasses. Also true. Oh, wow. My riddle brother, what's good? I'm putting my heart and soul into studying for college entrance exams. I'm burning with passion. Actually, uh, that's a big lie. Sorry. Didn't mean to fake the funk. My passion for school is just all burned out, man. Oh, that sparks my soul now are our riddle battles. I said I wouldn't let it, but me and the Riddle game are still magnetic. I'm begging you from Riddle Layer to Riddle Player. Step up to my challenge one more time. Mm, yeah. <laughs> Deny the funk. <laughs> Which we cannot do. We're not going to do it. Absolutely not. Except the funk. The Riddle Senpai's Encore. Oh my god. I knew you'd do it, man. Out of sight. Riddle brother, you all right. I'm scared already. Fire in the last riddle in my clip. This riddle's so parabolic, the energy will blow you over even if you're bro lick. Okay. I'm gonna put a bunch of things in order from greatest to least. You gotta give me the next item in the series. Can you okay. dig it? I hope Brazil, so. Italy, Germany, Argentina. Will your answer be a miss or a hit tonight? Is this riddle cake or is this your riddle crypt tonight? What comes next? Brazil, Italy, Germany, Argentina. Ooh, gosh. Those are the orders. Brazil, Italy, Germany, Argentina. Oh my gosh! I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. Brazil, Italy, Germany. Oh god. Brazil, Italy. Oh my god, I'm thinking too long too, but I'm trying to figure out what it could be. <laughs> Italy. Germany, Argentina, Italy. Oh God, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I feel like I'm just gonna. I want to guess because I don't want to just take up too much time just trying to think of everything. Um, 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 Brazil, Italy, Germany, Argentina. It sounds like somebody is stumped. I am a little stumped. I do want to guess something, though. So I'm going to guess Uruguay. Uruguay, you say? Why, oh my, what an interesting choice you've made today. Some of the crowd are on the pitch. They think it's all over. <laughs> oh. Well, it is now. You've gone around my back and scored. The frick? Correct. Brazil's won the most World Cup with five. Italy with four. Germany with three. Argentina and Uruguay each have two. Oh, wow. And with that, you have earned the golden brain. You've unraveled all of my riddles. We are truly riddle brothers. No, I see now that you are more than that. You're a riddle hero, man. As the one true riddle hero, let me help you up with this. It's a small thank you for all the battles we've had. Three soul food. <laughs> 
Thank you, Riddle Hero. That last battle was just what my soul needed to stay funky fresh. You know, studying for college entrance exams will be a breeze compared to the Riddle battles against you. Much love. Oh, thank God. I feel like you must have leveled up my, my persona's luck at some point during all this, too, for me to have gotten that. <laughs> you think you have a persona? Yeah, of course <laughs> I do. <laughs> I absolutely have a persona. <laughs> it's prop with, with, with mythology and stuff, mine's probably like Dionysus, but I still have one. That will be the closest thing you'd have. Oh, shut the heck up. Shut the front door. Did you manage to avoid catching a cold? I hear the weather this year is intense. In fact, we did not manage to avoid catching a cold. I just happened to be listening to my crystal radio. I always find it soothing for some reason. I keep hoping that I'll hear that girl's voice, too. I think you're old. This... This is it! Where in the world did you... Oh no, it doesn't matter. I can recreate the crystal radio from my childhood with this. I can't wait to listen to it. Thank you, thank you, thank you! I don't know if this is enough, but please take this. Spirit radio. Of all the radios I've built, this is the best. It's still, it'll still break almost immediately, though. Wow. But hey, this is my best radio. Cool. What's different about it? Oh, no. It's the same as the other ones we, he's given us, isn't it? Uh, I mean, I'm sure it's a little bit different. Uh, do, do, do radios. Okay. Uplifting radio was raising everybody's attack. And. Alright, where's the other one that he just gave us? Is that shit? I must have gone past it. Uh, Spirit Radio. Restores all of an ally's SP. Oh, that's super sweet. Alright, that's actually good. Nice. I'm good for that. Oh, yes. Yikes, it's a really cold winter. My hands were shaking so much, I actually hit it with a hammer the other day. What should I do if I bang myself up anymore? No man will want me. What? Just take this wood. <gasps> wow! Maybe this classy lumber will want me. I, I mean, I'll be able to make an excellent shelf with this. <laughs> Can't wait to see the look on my dad's face. Thank you, senpai. Here's something for you. As always, thank you so very much. Cool. Assault signal. Yeah, I'm gonna assault you with it. What? Hey! I need, an, I need an adult. <laughs> <laughs> Sure. Uh, let's go to Okina next. Oh, it's time. More crane game. And a few <gasps> other things. The claw. Give me that King Frost. Come on, let me have it. Game, please. I just got a McCoy doll. Give me a King Frost doll. I always have to put that on a thing. I wonder what it looks like. I mean, it looks like McCoy. But I don't know what a McCoy Wait, is. I'll right. learn. Wait, that's right. We've already... No, I mean, we've, we've had a McCoy. Sure. We have? I'm pretty sure. Oh, it's probably like an enemy or something. Interesting. I mean, it, it's a persona. Oh! M maybe, maybe we just never used it. We like we got it and we never did anything with it. Besides, uh, that, away. that one doesn't sound sound like it would stand out too much. It's no friggin' Belphegor. True. Hey you! I saw you riding that bike. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I knew it. The police station are useless. You have to help me. It's my Minori Chan. She's missing. I thought she'd be fine since Sakari Chan was with her. She's wandering off sometimes by herself. What if she winds up in Inaba and somebody kidnaps her? You can look for a bike, right? Can't you? Go look for Minori-chan in Inaba. Sure. Like you I'm counting on here. If you call her name Minori-chan, she'll answer. She really likes fish. I hope she isn't eating stuff off the ground that she's not supposed to. 
Oh, 61. Found my pet. Part two. I got so worried for a second because it sounded like the one going after her dog. I'm like, oh my god, did we miss this somewhere? And I was like, oh my god, now what? So, but now it's a, it's like a cat and it's part two, so thank god. <clears throat> I'd like to introduce you to a new arrival. Gentlemen all across the country, the wait is over. We have the maid set. <gasps> Welcome home, master. Oh, the good life of being rated on hand and foot. The title is to die for. I'm Lumiere. I mean, Reko Osa, charismatic fashionista. So, yeah. We, uh... Oh, there it is. We can buy the maid set now. God. I hate it. You hate the, you hate the maid set? I hate the whole maid thing. I don't- I will never understand the maid thing. Whatever. I- I- I don't want to talk about it anymore. Let's go to here. Okay. Oh, they Oh, we oh. haven't- you're- yeah. It's awfully cold today. It only makes my heart burn to create art. I wonder if anyone will bring in some rare materials for me. By the way, I heard a rumor. They say you caught the Samagello River's guardian, eh? Will you let me take a look at it? Quest 60. Acquire Samagello's guardian. You have it right now? Well, will you let me have it? Yeah. Ooh. So this is it. The fish they call the guardian of Samagello. <laughs> hey, wait a right there for a second. Sorry about the wait. Inspiration suddenly struck and I had to go make something with the materials I had in the back. I wanted to take it as a token of my gratitude. Ooh. Ooh. It's a kanji weapon. Mm. I sure asked a lot of favors of you, huh? Thanks for all the help. So I was really hoping, because I know that the trout are like the two handheld ones for him. I was really hoping for a really big fish that we wielded as a sword. I was really hoping for that. Whoa. It's stronger than the demon shield. Uh, is it worth the accuracy drop? Yes. Well, and also, we do need to see him yield a friggin' fish. And it's 50 SP. Dang. Like, we lose four endurance, but it's 50 SP. Dang. Okay, okay, yeah. I'm good with it. All right, now we did all of that. Let's go a little bit more, we'll do it. There's gonna be a cat here. Oh, hi, dude. It have... actually is going to be a don't we, don't we have that guy's thing, too? All right, that is the guy. That's the eternal lamp, right? Not a no, modest. He wants a modest one. <gasps> a ton of stuff happened last year. The murders, the fogs, meetings, and partings. What's this year going to be like? Nah, I'm not going to think too much about it that just yet. I plan to just enjoy this quiet, snowy scenery for a while. Take your lamp. The man is looking at the lamp. Thank you, really. Thank you so much. I didn't give you much to go on, but you brought me exactly what I wanted. It isn't much, but please take this. 45,000 yen. I'm going to give this to my wife. She passed away, so I thought she might like some light. <gasps> oh, my heart. Thank you so much. Let's go find so that cat. I just thought of something. Uh huh. Wild curb theory here. Oh. But you know, like you know how the, um, the other world, the TV world, they're saying it's based on everyone else's thoughts and emotions and pulling from them and stuff, right? Sure. Well, if you think about it, whatever that guy's thoughts were, were definitely projected in there. So if you think about it, the exact lamp he wanted was somehow portrayed in though it was somehow portrayed there in that other world some of those desires are things that he wanted so it almost makes a little sense that some of these things that people are wanting are being dropped by things that could have been created by their very own thoughts and emotions in the tv world you finally got it what do you mean i finally got it you finally got it okay that's exactly what's going on oh my god i'm not even kidding here i don't know i thought they were just drops and stuff 
Uh, actually, can you before you check, can you go to the right a little bit more for me, please? There was something yeah, else I needed. Yeah, to come there in. were a couple kittens. Oh my god! Yeah. <gasps> I will take them both. <laughs> That's gonna be a problem. Why is it gonna be a problem? Because I'm taking them. Swap snooze. Uh, is that not the cat? Uh oh. Uh oh. Where else would the cat be? I, I don't know. We accepted the quest. It said it was supposed to be here. It said it was supposed to be at the. What? Look at that one. Maybe that's the cat. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I oh, couldn't. Definitely. I couldn't see the quest icon at first. That was just tough. It in. How sneaky. An unfamiliar cat is staring at the fish in the river. It's McGonagall. What? Maybe you should try calling its name. McGonagall. No. It's Minori Chan, right? I think so. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I got thrown off a little because Chidori is a P3 character. Right. There's no response. Maybe you should try another name. Midori Chan. There's no response. Midori's you alcohol, though. <laughs> Chidori. There's no response. You should try another name. Should you wait until it notices? Sure. Yes. Meh! It seems to have noticed you, but it is more interested in the fish in the river. What could you do to make it show more interest in you? Fish. Should you give it a fish or try and catch its attention? Uh, Eat a guardian. So, <laughs> well, no, we actually need to give it a specific fish. Okay. So we need to give it a... Check to make sure I got the right name. A red goldfish. <gasps> the infamous cat carried the fish off somewhere. You don't think it'll be back today. Alright. Now that we've finally done all the, the extra stuff, let's actually go mm -hmm. do our uh, something that'll take up some time today. Sweet. We did a lot. That didn't take really? up any time at all. Dang. <gasps> Are we finally going to finish this one? Whoa, that was weird. I saw that too. Holy. What the heck? That was... Mm. Mm. Uh -huh. Yo, Ryoka, go to practice. You feel your relationship won't advance yet. We're just going to spend time. All right. Well, let's go. So we didn't need strength for this. You give it your all at soccer practice. And your relationship will become closer soon. Nice. Welcome home! <gasps> oh. Oh, that's right! I'm from Nanachan a while back, but you're raising vegetables! That's not fair! I want to grow veggies too! Teddy went outside. Oh no. You can hear his voice. Woo! It's cold! What's this? Sensei, look at this! Come on, dig with me! Hold on, it's cold, so I'll go change! You just got better, you better dress warm! Here, here, try digging here! Look, Sensei, something's coming out. Or is it my bead melons? You found a hibernating bug in the ground. Tatsuhime ladybug. Inaba jewel beetle. Tatsuhime ladybug. Yasuo locust. Daimyo grasshopper. Daimyo grasshopper. So when it snows, bugs burrow into the ground. Hey, they're so shy. I bet Nanachan will be surprised when we tell her we harvested a bug. Sensei, my hands are getting cold. We can't have you getting sick again, too. Let's go back inside and warm up the kotatsu. Since our hands are cold, we'll have to hold hands, Sensei. Oh, no. That was fun. My hands are freezing, and we weren't able to raise any vegetables. But it was fun. Let's do it again sometime. With the snow piled up, you can no longer raise vegetables. You can, however, look for hibernating insects. Use mm. the gardening tools and you want to search for insects. So now if we want to get bugs, we don't do the bug catching anymore with the net. We just go dig them up and there's no little mini game or whatever. We just get them. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. That's cool. That is kind of cool. Let me go back inside. Look at that coat. Guess what's different now? Or rather, I should say, what's back to normal? Oh, wow, it's Tuesday. What the heck? 
Hello everyone and welcome to Tonica's Amazing Commodities. This is Tanaka's Amazing Commodities, the mail order television program being broadcasted live to you. We guarantee your purchase will meet your satisfaction for a fair market price. Now let's introduce the products available for these three days. It's Otto Mataru, <gasps> overflowing strength for everyone. <gasps> oh my goodness, I can't believe it's wonderfulness. It's pretty much HMO4. <gasps> I'll add wasabi jelly to your Otto Mataru, all for the low price of only 49,800 yen. But we've got another fantastic product on sale today. Tetracorn. <gasps> Guaranteed to protect you from harm. On top of this, I'll add Macaricorn to your Tetracorn for only 9800 yen. These products are so popular we can only allow one order per person. Which would you like to purchase today? You can only buy one. What you thinking? Oh boy, because like both of them, I feel like there's stuff we probably got already. Like I feel like we might have gotten this. Uh, I know we definitely gotten the corn. The Mat auto Mataro seems like something we might not have gotten already. So that's why I'm kind of leaning towards the auto Mataro. I agree. Okay. Sweet. Now we can teach him a chap's Machamp strength. Woo! All right. I'll see you next time. Now, we're gonna go do a little bit of fishing. Fishing? Fishing. At night? Yeah. Uh, cause we need to, like, get, wow. we need to get specific fish for the cat. And while I was uh, looking some things up, mm -hmm. I found out that we were short a few fish. So, oh, wow. we're gonna rectify that right now. Good, good, good. We need to get an eat of a trout and another guardian. Another guardian, oh my god. Because mm -hmm. we just gave one to, do, to uh, um, uh, fuck. Sword Daidara. Game. Daidara, thank you. So, let's uh, get fish. And it is a... Eat up a trout. Eat up a trout. Perfect. That's one of them. All right. Let's get that guardian. Guardian. Uh, it'll be this one. Eat yep. him a ghoul beetle. Oh, uh, Puesh is guardian. That isn't it, though. You're right. It's not. I was I was not even going to pull it back because I wasn't thinking about it. That's not the guardian either. I remembered. I remembered the ripples. See, I know things. I know some things. That's because you're Thank not God it's that way. Ah, this is definitely it. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Oh, there that was go. close. Blah, 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 blah. All right, so we could fish more, but there's really no need to. So we're just going to, interest of time, go home. Roger that. <gasps> Whoa. Well, hello. Um, Ryoko-kun, do you have some time at the school today? There's something I'd like your opinion on, so... I anyway, I just hope you're free. Seems you could want to talk about something. Hmm. I'm definitely curious, because it's like... It seems like this would be the... Oh, hello. Senpai! Senpai, you're not busy today, right? No plans at all, right? Uh, there's something I want to talk to you about, and... You're the only one I can rely on, so I hope you can make it. Huh. We've definitely finished their social link, so that's why I'm definitely like, huh. What's happening here? What's happening here? Here you are, Sensei! It's been a while since I came to school. Every day's great here, after all. Wait, every day's great here? At your Junas. What? <laughs> um, there's something I want to talk to you about. A man-to-man -man talk, just between the two of us. If you have time, come by Junez. 
fingers cross, Sensei! Seems Teddy was attacked by someone. Who's the next party member? I knew it! What is going on here? Good day. Hello, Ryoko-san. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. That was odd. I was daydreaming there for a second. In any case, if you're free after school, I'd like you to come with me somewhere. Well then. Yeah, so now we're just waiting for Chie, Risei, and Yosuke. Or not. What the heck? That's weird. That's really weird. Is there a reason? Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Let's go feed the cat. Okay. Because I'm so curious, especially because we had, like, we finished all of those people. Hi, cat. Don't give the old man the fish. We gave him a lot. Let's give the fish... The trout. The trout. <gasps> oh, you have to let your cat eat the entire fish while remaining wary of you. Mm-hmm. So, you want to know what's going on, right? I do, yes. What if I told you? Mm -hmm. What if I told you? There was... Uh, how do I put this? Four of our friends, four of our uh, compatriots here, our, our party members. Ooh, what is, do we have what she had There was one? essentially a rank 11. Oh, um... What does she want? Oh, yes. wow, we missed her. Okay. Oh, this is it. I don't believe it. Oh, thank you so much, senpai. I'm so glad I could finally complete my art piece. Please accept this as a token of my gratitude. Three physical mirrors. All right, now I... Uh, oh, we... I, I, broke, I broke out of my Kate Denson voice for her. <laughs> I'm now going to have to double check. Okay, there's nothing else that we missed. Cool. Nice, now, okay. What if I told you that for our party members, there was what essentially equates to an 11. Right? Oh my. Added to the golden version of Persona 4. That's exciting. Let's see what happens. <sighs> oh, it's re it's now until we're choosing? Mm-hmm. Ryoka-san, if you don't have any special plans, perhaps you'd like to spend some time with me. There's nothing serious, but there is something I'd like you to hear. Seems not wants to talk about something. Let's go find out what. You have my gratitude. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I wish to take a another look at this town with you, while you're still here. Nato seems happy. Interesting. This place is covered in snow too. It's chilly, but I like the winter and its tranquility. Things have become so peaceful lately. I finally feel like I've gotten used to it. The people of Inaba are thinking about the events that transpired and are making an effort to make the town better. That sounds great. I've heard mm -hmm. that a lot of local government projects are being considered, such as bringing back old festivals. It would seem that they're trying to revitalize the town commercially, but I think the people yearn for connection. Good. Mm -hmm. Nato smiles gently. But as time passes, everything fades away eventually. Mm -hmm. Whenever I handle a serious case, I always come across a certain problem. Man can forget about painful memories, and in doing so, wipe away tears and learn to stand up again. But because we forget, we repeat the same mistake that caused those bad memories in the first place. Being able to get used to difficulty is a strength. But people make mistakes because they get set in their ways. But after meeting you, I feel as if I've found an answer to these doubts. I feel that as long as you can find something precious in your heart, something to protect, you'll be okay. And as long as you have that precious someone, no matter how much you forget, you can strive for a better future. Of course, mm. I have people who are precious to me as well. That's why I'm thinking about doing whatever I can for them too. This isn't just about me. I draw my strength from everyone else. They keep me alive. I've never considered things like that before. Aww. And of course, the ones who taught me to think that way are none other than you and all my other friends. Thank you. Really. 
Nato smiles cheerfully. Really? Again? Nato's heart, having developed over this difficult year, attains greater power. Nato's persona has been reborn again. Yamato Takaru has transfigured into Yamato Sumaraki. Whoa. Look at that hair. <laughs> and has learned Shield of Justice. Shields the party from all damage once. Whoa. So, uh, we're taking that. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, honestly, I'm gonna... We're gonna drop Mamudu. Okay. There's a new power budding in my heart. I wonder if this means that I'm still capable of change. I'm going to keep learning from here on. And as long as I do, I can always change. That doesn't just apply to me. I'm sure the same can be said about you, too. Love is frightening. It often brings out a part of me that I wasn't aware of. But no matter how I may be, you will accept me as long as I'm not deceiving myself. And in turn, I want to stay true to myself so that you will continue to love me. Oh, wow. Um, you have no idea how hard it is for me to not break into Whitney Houston right now. And I, I will always love you. I don't know if I should answer that, though. I'm going to be scared if I have to answer that for all the girls. And it's going to be like, one of them, I'm still breaking their, at least, at least three party members. I will be breaking their hearts in Valentine's. And I am not looking forward to it. <laughs> Um, there's no need to worry. I am going with that one. <laughs> I'm not worried. Actually, I think I am. I want you to stay with me. Not in front or behind, but at my side. And I want to be someone worth standing next to you. Mm. You sense Nato's intense love for you. Wow. You spend a long time with Naoto discussing all manner of things until it gets dark out. So, Dang. yeah, all of our party members can go under a uh, Persona oh, Evolution. Very so, cool. That's cool. And there's our oh. Mataru. That came instantly. Wednesday. And Teddy also said he bought food for us, so let's check the fridge. I'm scared for what he put in there. There's a variety of food inside. You could make lunch for tomorrow. Let's make lunch. Ooh. <gasps> you look at the leftovers that Teddy brought back from Juness. You have the ingredients to make gyoza. <gasps> you season the ground meat and mix in the vegetables. All that's left is to wrap them and pan fry them. Hold it right there. Cooking needs a pinch of something to enhance its flavors. Let's see. This and this. Or oh, maybe this. Put in one of those. Teddy hands you a number of ingredients. Which one should you use? Oh, wow. Inside of gyoza? Interesting. I'm pretty sure it should be olive oil, right? Because the other ones seem like it'd be really weird in contrast, like what gyoza really is, I think. Yeah, this one's kind of a gimme. It's yeah. olive oil. Mm-hmm. Pour olive oil onto the frying pan. Cook the gyoza. I would love to see the answer for trying to pour rock candy into it before putting the gyoza in there. I what can imagine the hell? it would be bad. Exactly. Suddenly, a savory scent fills the kitchen. It came out perfectly. It looks delicious. We obtained Italian gyoza. Italian? Yeah. Ooh. We'll cook with Italians. The Italians. What? Lunch, Lunch break. break. Brought your lunch today. Who would you like to have for lunch? Who, who would I have for lunch? Am I eating them? Who, 
Who do you want to eat lunch with? Anyone Can we pick whoever? Folks? Anybody that is a student. Oh. So, Yosuke, Chie, Yukiko, Kanji, Risei, Naoto, Naoki, Ai, Daisuke, and for you. Okay. I want to seat lunch with Kanji. All right. Yo, man. You ate lunch with Kanji. This stuff's awesome. Wow, this is so good. My old mom can't cook this well. Mind making my school lunches? I'm gonna mm -hmm. not tell your mom that you said that. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. All right, so uh, let's go find the cat. Yep. I love how you keep always running into that old man every time, though. I mean, this time we're going to feed it some huge fish. Fish! The unfamiliar cat ate the fish without minding your presence at all. Mm. And then he ran off. All right. Did it say we seem to have developed a liking or something? Mm -hmm. Perhaps. Mm -hmm. There's something that we need to finish. <gasps> We're gonna finish Daisuke and Coco? It's time. It's time! Uh-huh. Yo, Yoga, going to practice? Let's do it. Oh. So we don't need the Persona for this one, though. No, because it's ranked in. I forget. It doesn't matter what we choose. I wasn't aware. I wasn't 100% sure. Because it seemed we always had it for the others, so I wasn't sure. Not, no, ranked 10 has never mattered unless, there's, unless you're trying to go for a romance with, like, you, me, and I. Oh. Gotcha, okay. Come on, guys. You haven't fin even finished your knee lifts yet. Huh? I can't run anymore. I can still do it. That's when you gotta push yourself. <coughs> Come on, one more lap. I'll run with you. Yes, sir. Yoga's like, F that. Daisuke is coaching with passion. Huh. <sighs> It feels like forever since I've been this exhausted. <laughs> but damn, it feels good. I'm not gonna screw around anymore. From now on, it's all business. <laughs> Daisuke suddenly appears pensive. I keep pretending that I was trying my hardest. But the truth is, I was hardly trying. If I managed to do well in, with ha playing half my potential, Nobody really cared I wasn't taking it seriously. And if I was doing so hot, I'd have a cop out. All I'd have to do is say was say I wasn't trying. I'm scared of the possibility that things could go wrong, even when I gave it my all. Because if that happened, I would have felt like I had no business even being here. Pretty lame, huh? This is for you. Uh -huh. A spike brush. Huh. It's a brush you, you can use to clean your cleats. I realized I haven't used it in a long time. I just soaked my cleats and let them hang dry like I didn't care. But I used it to like, I used to like cleaning my cleats and soccer balls. I don't know why I'm doing this. It just kind of popped into my head, you know? I'm not super fancy or anything, but it's easy to use. You and I are going to be running a lot from now on, so... Was Daisuke not, right, Daisuke not know we're leaving in the spring? <laughs> oh my. Come on, let's grab some grub before we go home. Coco? There he is. <laughs> I've been hearing talk about you, Daisuke. He's a new man. A demon awoke inside of him. Words to that effect. Yeah, well, I quit pretending. It was getting pretty bored of not taking things seriously. You give it 110%, and sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. Not knowing, it, not knowing is what makes it fun. Mm-hmm. Ain't that the truth. Lay the charm on thick. Get rejected and cry about it later. That's a woman for you. Wait, we're switching to this now? <laughs> Still too bad about your ex, though. <laughs> 
You were kind of hoping she still liked you, right? What? But hey, that's not. <laughs> oh boy, look at his face. I think I've seen tomatoes less red than that. What about you guys, huh? All that what I am to you shit. You're the ones that should be embarrassed. <laughs> what? You want to say it again? Maybe in unison this time? Oh, oh don't give me that touchy feely crap. <laughs> you spent quality time with Daisuke and Go. Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh... Thanks, man. Thanks. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll always be here to embarrass you. Gee, thanks. They feel a deep bond is formed between you, Ko, and Daisuke. Shing! Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a genuine bond. These genuine bonds shall be your eyes to see the truth. We bestow upon thee the ability to create Zhao Gongen, the ultimate form of the Strength Arcana. Hooray! I feel like I can finally move forward again. That's good, man. So, let's do another group date. Ko, you should call those chicks up again. Really? Huh? Well, now you're gonna pull 180 on me? Dude, you really ticked those girls off last time. Well, I guess you'll have to do some groveling then. Me? Thanks. You take a moment to enjoy the good times with your friends. The film you have formed a tight on. Wait, what about the group date? We need an eighth girlfriend. Come on. Sorry. Welcome back. Hey, why is he calling us big bro? Ah! Because he's trying to be cursed. And he's succeeding. We got cursed. <laughs> All right. I think at this point, there's never anything that we need to do at night anymore. As oh. It's just like, oh, hey, if you want to make models, you can. But we don't really cat! care about that. Yeah, cat. He's right there. He's in the cold. Hope he lives. thing. So instead at night, we're just gonna look around and see if there's any of our social links out here and we'll just talk to them tonight. Like we say. Senpai. Oh, hey Senpai. I was just looking at the sky. The air is so clear that you can see all the stars. It's beautiful. So yeah, if you have time, you wanna talk for a little? Yeah, sure. Mm. Really? Yay, I get to spend time with you. Rise seems happy about that. Oh, it's cold. <sighs> I should have bundled up more. Inaba's winters are harsher than I pictured them. I can't take off my sweats inside the house anymore or wear anything but thick socks. <laughs> Not that you'll ever see me in that get up. Do you do that too? Wear casual clothes around the house, I mean? Uh... It doesn't matter, you can choose whatever. I know, I know. I wear sweats too. <laughs> We're on the same page then. Oh, but I bet you could totally rock a sweatsuit though. The other day I ran outside for a bit and ran into Kanji. He was wearing a sweatsuit, too, that looked completely natural on him. Talk about another man with me. You enjoyed your idle chat with Rise. <laughs> well, it's already so late, but I don't want to leave you. Le leave you. I don't want you to leave yet. Words. <laughs> I shouldn't be so clingy, I know. Hey, Senpai, I want you to have this. I want you to have it, Senpai. A love marshmallow. <gasps> it's a special something just for you. Keep it to yourself, okay? Well then, good night, Senpai. All right, we're going to go ahead and uh, end things right there. And we'll pick up next time with uh, some more hangouts. See you all then. Bye, everyone.